The Commission on Elections on Bank rejected calls to extend the voters' registration period beyond September 30. Janice and Henta will tell us why live. So Janice, what was the reaction of senators and congressmen who requested for the voter registration to be extended? Early legislators are disappointed by the Commission on Elections decision to reject calls to extend the voter registration period. In a statement, Senator Risa Montevero says that she was saddened by the Paul Bodice decision. Nevertheless, she welcomes the longer registration hours set by Comelec. Meanwhile, House Deputy Speaker and Cagayan de Oro Representative Rocos Rodriguez is not in favor of the extended registration hours. If you extend it in the, to the evening, you know, the even chances of uh, social distancing will be uh, violated. So I'm not agreeable to extending the time uh, for the, our young people to go to the uh, polling place. Eh. May hirap na. So I am for extension of uh, registration, regular hours, well. tayo, and then up to uh, November 30. November. For Assistant Minority Leader and Act Teachers Party List Representative Franz Castro, Comelec's failure to extend voter registration is a denial of the right of citizens to vote in the coming elections. She said that many Filipinos want to register but are prevented by lockdowns in some areas, including Metro Manila. Comelec spokesperson James Jimenez said that the Ant Bank has decided against extending the voter registration period beyond September 30, 2021, citing concerns about the timeline of the preparations for the 2022 national and local elections. Citing operational concerns, we the, the commission is is uh, is concerned that if we delay the end of voter registration, it will also cause corresponding delays in all other preparatory activities, especially those that depend on the finalization of the list of voters. And that will uh, that will have the potential to adversely affect the timelines in the preparations for the presidential elections. The commission anonymously approved the extension of registration hours and the opening of voter registration on Saturdays and holidays for the remaining days of the voter registration period. In the meantime, even though uh, no extension has been granted, uh, the COMELEC will also allow the extension of voter registration hours, meaning to say voter registration will, will be longer on a daily basis. It will be open on Saturdays and holidays. That will have to be calibrated, no? Ibat ibang lugar, ibat ibang solution ang, ang kinakailangan. But Kamala clarifies the new schedule will apply only to areas under general community quarantine and modified GCQ. On the other hand, voter registration will remain suspended in areas under enhanced community quarantine, even those in modified ECQ. Carlene, so far, there are over 60 million voters who have already registered for the 2022 national and local elections. Carlene? Thank you so much, Janice Inhente.